This looks massive. Yeah, I just want to say something quick. Right, I watched a video this morning. The guy said he found the cheapest burger in the whole of Thailand. Right, but I actually think this is cheaper. Hello, I'm Rianne, and this is my husband. <laughs> Thailand. Hi guys, welcome back. It's the next day. We're just checking out of our place. This is where we've been staying for four nights. Um, it was alright, but it's like a box room. As you can see, there is no windows in it, and I'm not a fan of that. But it did the job. We had a kettle, and they gave us like shampoo and lotion, and it was an alright bathroom. And the TV, we didn't even turn it on, but clean towels. But we're checking out. We're going to go downstairs. Just grab a car. Oh, there was AC as well. It wasn't the best, but whatever. And then there's somewhere out here. There he is. Well, let's go and check it out. Today we've got to get an overnight bus. We're going to arrive in Thailand, just across the border, about 8 a.m. So it's, we leave it, it's about 12 hours, really. I'm not really looking forward to it, because the last time we did an overnight coach, I think the last one we actually did is when our laptop and drone got stolen. So yeah, I'm a little so bit we'll, nervous. We'll have to be careful with our bag. But anyway, right, $2, I bought this, yeah. It's not Starbucks, it says, Malaysia since 1963, yeah? 1963 is when the Malaysia Agreement was. July the 9th, there you go, information. Lucky guys, you know some pointless facts now. But we are just walking to Starbucks. But look at this view in front of us. There's some famous Twin Towers. So the last few hours, we've just been chilling out this mall in Starbucks, but Wi-Fi's not great and we're trying to get video up. So we're gonna go and grab our backpacks from the hotel and then go to the bus station and hopefully find a spot there with better Wi-Fi. But we just ordered a grab. Ordered the grab um, is one minute away, so... We should probably go outside. The problem is, as soon as we go outside, we lose Wi-Fi, so... Yeah, um, let's go and meet. 18, 18B we're looking for, guys. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Well, we're back at our hotel. We've grabbed our bags. We've just been using the Wi Fi in the hall and we just ordered another taxi, another grab. Um, this one's costing us about £10, though. The one before was £4. This is £10. And it's normally about a half an hour drive to the bus station, but this time it's going to be about an hour. So the traffic's really bad. Yeah. Thanks, hon. Thank you. Thank you. Got everything here, Ben. Thank you. What bus are we? Uh, she says Susanna Tony Coach. So we're at the bus terminal now, the taxi just dropped us off, that was such a long taxi drive. The traffic is horrendous, so make sure you leave with enough time, luckily we left with hours. But we just got to find which bus we're going with and then get them to give us the tickets. Uh, two tickets. Gate number 12? Gate number 12? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. That was nice and easy, we've got our ticket. Gate number 12, and then we've got them Ben. So we've got 45 minutes for wee, food, 
and drink. Let's go. Let's stop toilets. Go. Oh, do you want me to take the little backpack? Bye. Looks like it's quite a big bus terminal. Um, we haven't really got that long to explore it. We're going to see because we haven't eaten all day. We just realised that and it's like 7.45 in the evening. Craziness. So it looks like you can buy your bus tickets here, obviously. We did ours online, which is easier. Um, there's a lot of convenience stores, another point. That's the second one I've seen there. Ben thinks there's a lot more upstairs, so I'm going up there because I heard the word Dunkin' Donut, so that's a bit of me. Sandals and socks. What a clown. You get some uh, donuts for the journey. Yeah, 100%. What do you think I'll we'll come upstairs? Yeah. There's loads of places. You've got Mary Brown. Don't know if anyone's out there. Looks like deep fried chicken. Dunkin' Donuts. I can see a KFC up there. There is absolutely loads. So I'd get here early and eat here, just in case the traffic's bad. We're going to get a couple of Dunkin' Donuts, I think. Uh, one peanut butter jelly. Can I have the hazel filling one? Uh, thank you. Thank you. Next job, snacks. Pringles. Yeah. Now we've had a wee break, got a coffee and we've got a snack. Now we need to go to our gate because we are leaving a bit close now. We've got about 20 minutes, so let's get here. Uh, Number 12, that's our gate. This is how busy this bus sound noise. Look, this is just one floor and then bed. We've got under 20 minutes until our bus comes here and there's three people here. So. Yeah, but unless there's like a culture where everyone turns to the That's my type of culture. Yeah. That's me. Written all over. This is why we always get an evening bus because I can't do mornings. Thank you. handy space so we've got our USB there armed and we found a good spot to put our bag on Ben so we're just slowing our bag there we've got this strap safe push it down and then we can go sleep nicely with our bag secure between us but look how much room there is it's massive isn't it Ben it's very comfortable it's very well, a bit to put our donuts the only thing we're like missing is there's no tables because we were going to put the laptop out. Oh, yeah. But we're not. But there's a lot of people coming down, so I'm going to get in my seat. But as you can see, Ben's already been in the snacks. I put it all over me. I'm just stay with him. Yeah, but it was dark a minute ago. I thought it was hidden. <laughs> it turned the lights on. You want to see the mess on you? <laughs> well, embarrassing. So I did have shorts on, but I packed my joggers. And I put them on. Took my shoes off. I'm getting comfy. I've got a jumper for a pillow, I've got my jacket on. So I know what it gets like, the aircon gets chilly. So I'm comfortable and I'm ready for this nap. Slash sleep time, because this is when we're meant to be sleeping, it's not a nap. As we, as we stopped at the station, guys come on. I assume he's something to do with the station, but he's just give us a bottle of water. Well, he's give everyone a bottle of water. So 
Great service. Very, yeah, very good service. But there's no toilet on this coach, so I'm a bit nervous about drinking it. You know? Drink it, and then you can fill it back up. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that's true. In the yes, uh, basketball. Yeah. Stopped off for like a toilet break. He's collected our parcels up. We're just about to go for the border, but we got away here for about an hour, so just chilling out really. Thank you. Okay, round. What's that inside of them? Rival card. Rival card. Do you have luggage? Luggage? Yeah. We've we got luggage. Get off, yeah? yeah? So we just got through passport control. That took ages. Right, we was queued in this queue for like 20 minutes and then fought, well obviously ours was the slowest queue every other queue went really fast but now we're through i could officially say we're in thailand so we had another stop where the driver has to drive the bus through but we had to go and do like a scan a qr code and put in all our bloody vaccination thing and then immigration again but it was quite chilled they had like music on and that and it was quite easy wasn't it it's proper long-winded but I've got about 15 stems in the basketball now. <laughs> Let's go on a coach. We're pretty sure this one's ours. SIM card this up first. Oh, uh, SIM card? Yeah. Ah, uh, the by the way, so when you move it. This way, yeah? Yes. Okay. Today, where you go? Stay here or uh, be okay? Uh, we're going to J-Home, we're going to. Stay here. Stay here. We're staying yeah. here, yeah. Oh, okay. Living, living. Living, living. Yeah. Living. 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 this way, yeah? Thank you. So, the first job we need to do is new country, new SIM card. And that'll be the spot. Right, we've just got our SIM cards, yeah. I've got this one, I don't know how much data it's got. It was 150 baht. I couldn't believe how cheap it was. So, I'm ex fully expecting to put it in my phone and there'd be no data on it. We've just ordered a taxi out here. It's a grab again. So simple and easy. Oh, he's here. Let's go and find him. Ah! Don't kill me. Cheers, brother. Hello. So this place, obviously, it's not perfect. It's got aircon, uh, shared kitchen, and our own little sort of kitchen. Plus, it says got a washing machine as well, which is ideal. Um, it was three hundred and sixty baht a night, so cheap, cheap enough. So we all checked into our accommodation. We have just chilled there, had a little nap, refreshed ourselves, and now we are going for a wander to see what's about near us, and obviously to get some food. Yeah, we need to get some food. It's like half five, it's dinner time. So 
and all I've left off is Pringles today, so I need yeah. some proper food. I'm buzzing for some Thai street food. <laughs> Beef, yeah. Okay, uh, one burger as well. The burger. Yeah. yeah. Beef. 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 Chicken. Yeah. Beef or chicken? Uh, beef. 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 Yeah. Spicy. Spicy. Oh, oh, spicy. Yes. Spicy. Yeah. Uh, first of all, we're starting off with beef burgers. This is just a stand-up food store here. We've got her set up here. She's got a deep fat fryer there. Sausage. Thank you. Yes. Mm. We've got beef burgers. We just found a lovely little seat in the area just outside the shop here. This looks massive. Yeah, I just want to say something quick. Right, I watched a video this morning. And the guy said he found the cheapest burger in the whole of Thailand. Right, but I actually think this is cheaper. Well, look how big it is. Um, so she literally cooked it to order in a little kitchen there. Her, her area, considering how small it was, was spotless. It was so clean. It's cleaner than my kitchen's ever been, take that. I'm going to go in for a bite. It looks like we've got some melting cheese going on here. Elegant as ever. Well, there's a lot of sauces going on there. So you went to town with sauces. Mm. So you got your cabbage, cucumber, lettuce, uh, like mayo, ketchup, two double burgers, and then the bun. She even cooked that on the grill with the burger. It's really yummy. I'm actually surprised like how big it was coming, because I saw her cooking them and I thought, oh, they're quite little, quite thin, but look at that. So I'm going to dive straight in, right? Biggest boy in the world. That wrap, it's sort of like crispy like a pancake, and the sauce is really like, rich, almost like a little bit Almost a little bit sour, very good. And very salty as well. Oh, it's got a kick. <coughs> yeah, a little bit spicy. A little bit. This is, this is a man's food. Tell you what, that burger was a 10 out of 10. That was oh, well nice. Yeah, the sauce you put in there, it's delicious. But then it had a lot of salad in it, which made it There were oh. so, there so many different tastes. Unreal. That was amazing. Street food in Thailand. Next, we're going to see if we can find some like noodles. Oh, these drinks look cool though. How do I say thank you? Well, we're back at our room. We've got the fridge stocked up with some water, Ben's beers, and obviously Coke Zero, our all-time favourite. Yeah, it's, it's different. I don't know yeah, what we is. don't know what flavour it's going to be. Starshine. Star yeah. Sounds like, uh, like a cider. <laughs> um, but this is our dinner for tonight. We've got like chicken noodles. And they gave us like these seasoning packets. How good is this? Spicy sauce. And they even gave us these cool plastic spoons. Look at these. But it is going to be hard out here, isn't it, Ben? Because obviously it's another alphabet and they don't, a lot of people don't speak a word of English. So luckily there was quite a young girl, obviously, at school, knew a bit of English and kind of helped us. Yeah, but all the it's our own fault because obviously we've got data, so why aren't we using Google We're quite Translate. ignorant, so we're going to do some learning on basic words tonight and learning a bit more about the food. We felt a bit ignorant out there. Yeah, maybe so. we should just make a bit more of an effort. Really. We're going to. All right, well, we're going to finish the video here today. It's been a good day. We travelled far. We travelled from one country to the other, tried some amazing food, and we've got good accommodation, a good location, and the weather's good. Yeah, I think tomorrow we should show our first impressions of... Definitely. Yeah, of the area. But right, anyway, subscribe. Hi guys. Guys, <laughs> we are currently in Carl. We are currently in Kuala Lumpur. Snacks. 